We've got a challenge. Matt is wearing his. Yes. Have you ever worn a GPS watch, Matthew? I don't think I have. And you're strongly saying you're at the moment you're not really a fan, are you? I've never worn a watch playing golf. What have you got for us, Dan? I've got the hybrid today. So you've got a rangefinder plus. Yeah. Show me the front of that. Let's switch it on, shall we? Yeah. GPSM rangefinder, you're gonna test. Play golf. Oh, how far away am I, Ray? Ride a cup yard. Too close. Too close, ride a cup yard. He's trying the ride a cup special V4 or V4. Nice little ride a cup logo on it. Oh. It's nice. <laughs> England. What's this one called, Dan? Do you know? What's that one called? It's called a, a knee, knee. Neo. It's a Neo. I've got the Neo, which to be honest with you, I have stuck. It's magnetic, comes with a clip onto the buggy. Boom. That's and I'm loving cool. that, so that we're going to test. Bad. That's quite cool, I didn't know they did those. Yeah. Can I sell those? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just stuck it on the buggy because I'm not much of a... Oh, that's the new one. Oh. That's the new one. The yeah. plus. Oh, little Ryder Cup. Ryder Cup Samuel special. Ryder on the back. On it. We're nice. GPS lasering watch testing. Bushnell style. <laughs> <laughs> He's not even measuring Maybe the right way. He just, right. He just... I think I think there's a jolt version and a just a standard version. Oh. Well, you you do sell them. Yeah. Oh, that just jolted. Yeah, That's it got jolts. Jolt. It definitely jolts. Ping that flag. It jolts. In my age. Uh, oh yeah, it did. Oh, let got him. <laughs> jolted him. So let's start here with the hybrid. So this is the rangefinder hybrid, comes in this nice pretty solid box. Get your leads and everything in here. You also get, before we get onto the device, this smart carry case as well. I like this feature, it's got this little latch so you can zip it up or if you don't want to zip it up and unzip it every hole, obviously you can, it's quite secure just with this little toggle. Also got the hanging clip for your bag or wherever you want to put it. So I like the little hard case. Now if we look at the device itself, it's small, tactile, Style in the hands, a little bit of grip here on the top. It's also got this little bit of grip on the bottom. Feels great in the hand. You can see I'm, I'm wearing men's small glove. Fits in the hand really nice. So if we start with the laser, so the key features with the laser, it's a 400 yard range, which is plenty far enough. So you can shoot up to 400 yards. Five times magnification, so very clear through the viewfinder. Pin seeker and jolt technology, which is great with the Bushnell. Just locks on lovely to the target. Uh, accurate within one yard, and it's got fast focus system the other thing I love with this because it's the integrated GPS you get the GPS and the rangefinder numbers in the viewfinder which we'll explain as we go on GPS key features we get 36,000 courses in 30 countries preloaded you can use Bluetooth to update courses any changes or I think if you would not find your course it's got auto course recognition and auto hold advance. It knows where you are, moves you on to the next hole on the display. You get uh, front, middle and back as your markers on the heads up display. Like I say, you get it in the viewfinder as well. Also, you can connect this device to your app or to the Bushnell app, which will give you even more features, overviews of holes, scoring, those kind of things as well, I think. So it's an it's a very extensive piece of kit. The thing I like about it, we're gonna test it on the course that you're gonna see in a second. What I like about it is just how light and easy it is in the hand. So next product, Tor V4 Jolt Rider Cup Edition. So this one is featuring the lovely little Rider Cup logo, comes with the Rider Cup special carrying case, same clip ideas and zip if you want to zip it up for quick easy access. I do love this clip. Loving the badge on the front of this, Team Europe. Go Team Europe. So this is a rangefinder. It's five times magnification, accurate within a yard. It's got pin seeker and jolt technology. Really zeroes in on the flag, they say, which it does. You'll see it. We'll, we'll talk about it as we tie it um, out in Ireland. It's got stable grip on it. So you get this kind of, again, this tactile feeling top and bottom. Then the rest of it's more the shiny plastic. Feels great, light, small and comfortable in your hands. Fast focus system as well. In view LCD display. You got measurements in your yards and in meters if you want you've got a battery in here which you will have to replace at some point uh, three volt lithium battery and uh, it's rainproof 
which for anyone playing in this country, we're taking these to Ireland. That's not going to be a bad thing in Team Europe. Ryder Cup colours. If you want a V4 jolt and you want to give it some Team Europe, loving this. So then we have the Ion 2. So this is the watch, maybe the one I'm kind of least keen on, but let's see how that develops. So it's Bluetooth capable, allows for wireless course updates, comes preloaded 36,000 courses in 30 countries like the other GPS unit. So it's front, middle and back, easy to read. It really displays front, middle and back. So in the bigger number is the middle and then you got the front and back at the top and the bottom. You get four hazards as well, distance per hole. So you can go up four hazards like the bunker on the left, those kind of things. You get to the course, turn it on, it recognizes where you are, it finds the course, you literally just select it. It knows when you move to the next hole, it just moves on with you comes with this black kind of plasticky feeling strap with the blue on the inside it's an okay looking watch it's functional more than i would say it's super stylish you get integrated fitness counter on this one which is great for monitoring any kind of fitness which is good obviously for when you're walking on the golf course so you can play three rounds before you have to charge simply just charge it on the back here just clips on all very simple again you can connect this to the bushnell app all very simple and gives you a few more functionality points where you can look at holes those kind of things the device is also waterproof so you don't need to take it off if the weather's bad which is obviously going to be essential if you're out playing golf certainly in this country last but not least we've got this tiny little phantom device which i'm intrigued by actually i see people using these never use this looking forward to getting out there with this one this is a rider cup edition also fun uh, get the fancy little rider cup logo here on the back so it's Bluetooth allows for wireless course updates. You've got a battery life of two rounds before you have to recharge. You simply recharge with micro USB here in the bottom. Very simple, just plug it in like you would your phone, those kind of devices. Very simple interface. You get a front, middle and back reading. Also, again, like the other devices, you get the four hazards that you can choose as well. Auto finds your golf course. When you get there, you can see it saying play golf. Now I'm not at a golf course, but if I was, it would just find it. I mean, it would find the local ones to where I am if I press that now. You you can see on the back here you've got the select button so it's not touch screen as such you do have to use these buttons you've got the select button up and down your menu your shot and then your power off on top also comes with a little clip so you, this is magnet i've been um i'm probably going to stick this on the buggy when we get to the course but you can have a magnetic clip the clips on there so you can put it on your belt buckle on your bag wherever you want to clip it onto again this one you can connect it to the app to give you a little bit more functionality if you want to i just love the size of it look how small it is it's just so practical simple and easy with a good heads-up display 131 front 99 nine. and then 147 middle 161 back that's what i love about i've really started in this trip to actually learn to love these so i would play that as a 1312 yardage and then it just release up you're not gonna hit your one nine iron? Yeah. Because you're not gonna hit that one sixty, so you're not gonna hit the back. A little bit of drop off. Brilliant, gotta hit a good shot. Yeah, nice little fill up the left, locky back. Is it long enough? So well played, he's a He's got wind in the bones. Try and get it back there. 195 to the back, so I reckon I can hit a 195 shot. Oh, a little pump forward, lovely. Okay, good shot, that. Very nice. Verdict then, Dan. We've been in Ireland trying the multiple the Bushnell devices. Mm. What's your what's your what's your conclusions? Well, so we have the V. Did we did we tested the V4, didn't we? Yeah. So V4 Ryder Cup special. Ryder Cup special. Where's the little rider? Oh, on the other uh, side. There, there. Look, there it is. Right there. Little the rider. It's yeah. Nice. So that was really that was nice and small. Yeah. Um, really easy to use. I'm used to the big one. Oh, yeah, yours so, is massive, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, mine's a big one. So I found it a little bit harder to keep it stop shaking. Okay. But when you get used to it, it's uh, it's pretty straightforward. Jolt. Yeah, a little bit of jolt on that one. And that's nice. And that's locking nice. on. Yeah, so you're locking onto that flag. So, so I like that one. I see that, and I raise you. 
that yeah. kid there. So this is probably the best bushnel I've ever used. You what like that statement, isn't it? Um, same jolt. Same jolt. Similar size. Similar size, slightly, slightly wider, but still nice and small and compact. Um, but this added, I mean, why wouldn't you want this? Like, now that I've used it, front middle and back front middle and back it made such a difference for for when you're like so if a pin's tucked at the back of the green you know how far you've got until you get to the back edge of the green then yeah so you've got your flag then you've got your back edge so you know really that you don't want to be going long so then you've got you can build your club in you know uh, to make sure you don't go long so winner absolute winner for me these two yeah so then we've got the watch now i liked the watch go on um i'm not a watch user I don't wear a watch when I'm playing golf so mm. but I would I would probably use it as in I'd attach it to my golf bag okay more so than wear it on the golf course which is where this one comes in because it's magnet and then you've got the clip as well well that was quite cool well, wasn't it? it on the back oh that's a Ryder Cup special as well oh. isn't it oh. you hey. going there? <laughs> no I'm not going this year oh. Oh. you going back yeah, I'm so going. We better get back from Bally Bunyan first, then get to the right. Oh, oh. Portugal between us. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you there. boys are travelling, aren't you? <laughs> we no. are not at home this month. No. I do actually have to go back to work at some point. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this was cool. What I liked about this was the magnet in the back, so you could just clip that onto the buggy. Yeah, I had that on the buggy. You did, yeah. And I liked the fact that I could just clip it up there yeah. and there off I is. go. Yeah. And every time I get out, I just drive up and it was there. Yeah. So out of those two, what would you choose and why? Or is it just too close or what What do you think? Probably the watch. So you would, but you wouldn't wear it? I wouldn't wear it, but then, then I, it gives me the option to sort of like wear it out or something, you know? <laughs> and Measure how far the front, back and middle of the dance floor is. <laughs> <laughs> so Matt, you wore the watch the most, actually. You, yeah. You kind of, it's Got fair to say to you this. hated it and then you absolutely loved it. Yeah, so I never usually wear a watch because the old little little bit on the side here. Right, I, that the crown digs in. Yeah. But it didn't have that with this. So it was that, quite nice. Yeah, I, I, I was absolutely waiting for you to whinge all day when I made yeah. you wear that. And I got like, yeah. Like you were, just, yeah. Ooh, and then nice. you were one click away and you were finding how far the bunker on the left, bunker yeah, on the right. Yeah, handy as well instead of all the time. Like, yeah. I like that. That works well for me. And I then do. you also did use that as well because I had that on the buggy. Yeah. Because I didn't bring the charger for the watch, so no. it lasted a day and then we were a little bit out. <laughs> I got two, one and a half rounds out of it. Yeah. I don't know how much charge I didn't it was. charge it before it came as well, so I reckon you'd. Well, I don't know. I'll do some research on how many you would actually get yeah. out of it. Um, but yes, positive that. And then these two? Obviously, that's everything you expect it to yeah, be. Yeah, like if I'm gonna get one of these, I would get slope. Like, why wouldn't you get slope unless you haven't got that extra money? I guess, but yeah, with the option of taking it on and off yeah, if you wanted to play in competitions. competitions and stuff like that is a hybrid. This best of both wins. Again, it's going to be the most expensive, I guess. But so, if I was to give you one of those devices, that's the one you would choose, or would you go with a watch? Ooh. Competition me would go this. Me nowadays would go this. You're happy just to have Yeah. But like this it. is really good though. Yeah, because like, really it's everything, good. isn't it's got it? Got this and I love that when you look through it, you've got front and back up the top yeah. of the screen yeah. as well. Yeah. That's top of the screen, jolt and pin. It's like just everything. Get slope on there. It's almost there. like your terminator, you're just getting all the readings through. Just missing <laughs> slope, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I yeah. guess they just wait for next year for that one and then... Uh, well, I'll do it. Maybe you can put an attachment on and make it slow, but I don't think you can. Yeah. I didn't get one anyway, so... I want a slope GPS. Yeah. Lovely. That's what I want. I'm not sure they can make do that, that on GPS. I challenge you to make that. <laughs> so for me, that was my most pleasant surprise. I love the magnet. We only ever really play in buggies and I probably would clip it even onto my bag. Mm. Put it down, just have a glance. I like the glance and hit. 
So for instance, my mum's got one of them. I think the idea of her having to know where the pin is, she just doesn't care. Like She just wants to know where the middle of the green is. That's what she's aiming at. That's what she's hitting at. And to be honest with you, we are as well a lot of the time. I think, again, it's undoubtedly that's the winner because it's everything. But again, it's the price, isn't it? And also, lots of people don't want to have to do this. Some, I see lots of people, even some of my journey students, are like, what's it like? Because I can never quite fire it. I give these to Fanula or Milo, no chance. They just can't get it. Like, they don't even know really, well, why are you doing that? Yeah. Which again, which is where the watch and that one really do win. Like this, as well, has all your fitness stuff on it too, doesn't it? Yeah. Like people into that sort of stuff. Yeah. Well, you, you don't were, even have to be into it, do you? As in, just like on the course, you are game, exercising. How far, how, far uh, like, how far have we walked? How far have we walked, Dan? I'd be like, I don't know, two and a half yeah. miles. Oh, bang on, Dan. Uh, 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 closest guest gets a point. Game yeah. that's not a game, yeah. Game that's not a game. And you can connect this to your phone, right? Yeah, and then yeah. you start getting. So you you like, can text messages, endless. emails. Oh, brilliant. Tweets. Matt. I better just take that back. <laughs> yeah. He wants that. I might have that. <laughs> In DAC Club with my Bushnell. 